Hey guys, happy Friday. Welcome to episode 90 of OPTV. Uh, James, magnificent weather we're having. Weather is amazing, Lars. Yeah. Uh, obviously the site behind us, 24 Kincaid Road, Henley South. Uh, obviously they're well into construction, James, looking at completion late this year. Yeah, four bedroom, three bathrooms, upper garage home that we are uh, very excited to see, yeah. see being built. Uh, well, of course this week uh, we've got the election coming up this Saturday. Very excited to see that happen. Have you voted? <laughs> Indeed, I voted a little bit early. Yeah, well good, out, out of the way. There's a lot of talk at the moment in real estate about uh, the proposed changes as to who gets in, but uh, uh, won't get too much of that. We're here to talk about property. James, new releases this week. Uh, exciting few, yeah. property in Prospect. Uh, yeah, 72 Beecher Street Prospect. A 1925 character bungalow um, that's ready to make it your own. Uh, we've also got uh, an investment property in West High Marshall Lads that Kit's going to be uh, releasing this week. So excited yeah. to have that on board too. Fantastic. Uh, also, property management this week, we've got a great rental, James in Belfast Street, number 45. Yes, Henley uh, Beach. A bit of luxury there. An amazing and, home. Yeah, yeah great got amazing home. So. Uh, and property management, really kicking goals at the moment. Uh, look short time on market. Uh, it is a great time uh, for rentals. If you are looking at management or have any questions around it, get in touch with Charmaine or Michael and the team. Uh, so also this week, we caught up with Angelo Benedetti from Financia uh, to talk finance. So that's our second episode there. Uh, just discuss uh, pre-approvals. Um, yeah. Let's take a look at that. What are some of the loopholes or some of the things what, that banks might pick on? What they'll pick on at yeah. the moment, the hot, hottest topic is living expenses. So okay. um, things like um, getting your lawns mowed, um, yeah. Coffee every two weeks, your Netflix, yeah. all that sort of stuff. So the subscriptions? Subscriptions are a very big thing. Afterpay, okay. uh, a lot of people are just signing up and, and doing these things, not realising that will have a negative impact okay. on their affordability. So guys, for more information, uh, click on the link below to see the full interview. Uh, and obviously we talked about interest rates on hold again, uh, but I think we will see some changes in the next coming months. Uh, also, a big congratulations to Deming McDonald, uh, our Mother's Day winner. Yes. Uh, it's a secret by the sea, so we've got the voucher that's come out to you. Um, so James, heard you went there on the weekend? Yeah, I went there Sunday morning with Mum. Um, yeah, great little spot, lads. I'm very impressed about what they've done to it. It was a great meal as well, so. And awesome location. So James, um, property of the week. Property of the week this week. Last definitely 10 Belfast Street in the heart of Fulham Gardens. It's a Pretty little, good value? Definitely. Uh, 410 to 430, a little two bedroom place on a Torrance title allotment. Only a few kilometres away from the beach. Actually, and a good it might size be one. Yard. And a good size yard for the yeah, docks. So fantastic. Definitely check it out. The link will be in the description. And James, uh, the auction last night, a great result. 48 Military Road, sold by Ket Dong last night at Semaphore. Um, Brenton Lilicic was the auctioneer. He did a great job. So, advertised price $5.95, uh, beautiful home. Uh, they had some competitive bid bidding. James went up to uh, 651000 651, so great result for boys. Yeah, guys, so, uh, that's it from us this week. If you've got any questions, feel free to contact James and myself or the team at Oz Property from all of us here at Oz Property. Have a great weekend. Uh, happy Election Day Saturday. We'll see you this time again next week. <laughs> Ciao.